down in the meadow on a breezy day. Fuzby shouts, it's time to play! With sheets that dance on lines to dry. A windy whoosh sends him sky high. Mandy and Dino galloping fast. Oh dear, poor Fuzby, Mandy gasped. Fuzby and the Flippy Flappy Laundry Adventure by Teddy Snuggletail for Comfy Corner Time. Listen very carefully. The question for this story is What game did Dino and Mandy play? Answers at the end. Splish, splash. Scrubbity, 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 scrub. What a beautiful, bright, breezy autumn day, said Terry Toad, down at the babbling stream. All the woodland and meadow friends were hard at work. Today is wash day. Whoosh! Whoosh! Whistle! A strong breeze rustled the leaves in the trees. Orange, red and gold, crispy confetti floated down to the water. It's the perfect day for drying, buzzed Fuzzby. Bzzz, bzzz, bzzz. He buzzed along with excitement on this happy autumn cleaning day. I love wash day, danced Mandy Mouse before she slipped and ploof knocked poor Terry Toad into the water. Oops! It's a wash day! Hooray! Hooray! Fuzzby sang zooming around the heads of his friends. It's getting very windy, called Dino the Shetland Pony, his blanket between his teeth, sparkling clean and dripping wet. Mandy Mouse scrubbed her little paws and held up her tablecloth. Then a big gust of wind came and blew it into her face. Time to go hang them, called Dino, and the funny little trio headed off to the washing line. They pinned the clothes up on the line. The wind whipped and whooshed. Everything billowed and danced. Fuzzby, Stay right there, said Mandy. Watch the drying laundry and come find us when it's ready. OK, said Fuzzby and settled down to watch it. It floated in the breeze like giant clouds, flapping and swaying. As the hours ticked by, Fuzzby felt a little lonely. Mandy Mouse and Dino had trotted off to play a game of conkers. Everyone else was busy cleaning. Do you want to come and play, Fuzzby? Mandy called. But Fuzzby shook his head. No, thank you. I am the official linesman. I will let everyone know the very second this laundry is dry. The sun climbed higher and higher. Finally, by the time it was dipping low, Fuzzby noticed the sheets were crisp and dry. They're ready! The linen is dry! He buzzed with delight zooming to get Mandy and Dino. It's time to take them down! A very cautious Fuzzby 
lifted the first clip off the clothesline. Mandy Mouse held tight to the sheet so it wouldn't fall to the ground. Then he took off the second clip, the third, and finally the very last clip. But, oh, as he removed the last clip, a wild gust of wind came whirling in. Whoosh! The sheet slipped from Mandy's paws. In a flash, it wrapped itself around poor Fuzzby. Oh, no! squeaked Mandy. Hold on! But it was too late. The wind lifted the sheet and with it, Fuzzby too, high up into the sky. Fuzzby felt himself flipping and flapping inside the sheet, spinning round and round. Help! Help! he called, his tiny voice muffled by the big sheet. Thinking fast, Mandy scrambled onto Dino's back. Quick, Dino, after that sheet! We have to save Fuzzby! Whinnie! Ba-doom, ba-doom, ba-doom! His little hooves pounded through the meadow. They zigzagged between trees, racing after the giant sheet as it floated and fluttered higher and higher. Poor Fuzzby struggled, all tangled up inside. Hold on, Fuzzby! We're coming! shouted Mandy, leaning forward as they gained speed. Every time they got close, a fresh gust of wind whooshed the sheet even further. They chased it over the hill and past the pumpkin patch, through the tall autumn grasses, until finally they got close enough. Dino stretched out his neck and with one mighty chomp, he grabbed hold of the sheet in his teeth. With care, Mandy climbed down and started unwrapping the tangled, dizzy little Fuzzby. Round and round she went until, pop, out came Fuzzby, his eyes all whirly-twirly from spinning. Is it night time already? asked Fuzzby. Only I can see stars. Tabitha Cow, who had watched the whole scene, offered to help fold the sheet. We'd best keep this one from flying off again, she said with a smile. Together, Tabitha, Dino and Mandy folded the laundry placing it in a neat pile on Dino's back. Fuzzby climbed up too and they made their way back to the old oak tree for a well-earned mug of hot chocolate. Oh, what a day, said Fuzzby, looking at his friends with gratitude. I may not be big or strong, but I'm so glad I could help watch the laundry dry. Mandy Mouse smiled, giving Fuzzby a little nuzzle. And we're glad to have your help, Fuzzby. Sometimes we all need each other's help. Have you been listening carefully? Do you know... What game Dino and Mandy played? Yes, that's right! 
Dino and Mandy played Conkers. Well done! Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye!